Welcome back, my sea lovelies, to another episode here in the beautiful, the gorgeous, the insatiable Isles of Eden. Now, I've actually got to talk to Darkness Kirby a little bit from the last episode. And if you guys do not know who Darkness Kirby is, he is one of the two bat makers with KGB All Star. And the little house that almost got us killed, Joel's TNT house, uh, where was it at? I'm so confused. Oh, right here. You can see a little bit of the remains right over there where the crosshairs are. That was actually, um, I think one of their friends built a house. And since it was so, uh, it wasn't beautiful looking as many of these <laughs> islands are. So they put TNTs in it. And I loved I loved it. I loved that idea. Um, I like how they use their friends' stuff, and then they'll somehow come up with something to make it uh, blow up. Because you'll, you'll see little inside jokes scattered throughout the uh, islands uh, between them and their friends. And I love seeing that. Everybody loves to be a part of an inside joke. And when they created this map, they allowed... Oh, Ender Pearls. Nice. That is a good first island. Um... Yeah, and every, everybody gets to be a part of it. And I, I like how... I, I just love everything they've done with this. I really hope they create an Isles of Eden 2 or another CTM base map. 100% will do a series on it if it is anything like this. Um, so, where are we going to be headed today? Right there. That, my friends, is the end goal. It is a lush, beautiful green, jungle-themed... Biome. <laughs> I didn't know how to finish that sentence. Island, if you will. So we got a, few, we got about, we just hit up one island. So we got about eight more to go before we can do that one. And I'm trying to look at the path. Yeah. So this is the secondary. Yeah, we're gonna go this way. We're going down right here. Woo! <laughs> um, I actually was recording some of this, and then my Minecraft crashed, and so I've had to restart. Uh, that that's always a shame. Um, sometimes the the autosave will catch it, and I've learned sometimes that it doesn't catch it. Uh, very rarely has it not caught it for me, but luckily we are only a few minutes in, so um, I actually did a time lapse for this island the first time before it crashed. Hi, sheep. Hi, sheep. Bye, sheep. My island. Um. <laughs> Ooh. <gasps> that has a lever right there. Ooh. And that looks like a piston head. That looks like a piston head. So I'm assuming if we pull that, something's going to get pulled out from under us. We need to proceed with caution, my sea lovelies, when we are at that island. I haven't been to that island yet. Uh, my Minecraft crashed when we were at this. That one. That one. So, I did a time lapse on this one. There was just nothing but coal and iron. So, we are going to just move onwards and save our little time lapse for a different island. Um, but, yeah, I'm actually recording this to give myself a little bit more time for an episode in my main series. I don't want to spoil what it's going to be, but I've already put in uh, like a 30 hours ish, I'm guessing, maybe a little bit more. Um, it's a massive build. I don't know why I keep having to record all this, <laughs> like like the way I do. Um, I actually know why I do, and I'll, I guess I'll I'll tell you guys because the people that are watching this right now are the most hardcore of the Seal of Gaming subscribers, the Seal of Gaming family, if you will. You you guys might actually care about some of the behind the scenes stuff. Um, the reason why I finish most of my projects now and I put in like 30 or 40 plus hours in is because I'm a small YouTuber and I'm trying to make a name for myself. And when people randomly search for my YouTube channel and look up a video, uh, they are interested in seeing like a full product pretty much from start to finish. And they're not interested in like it being broken up into three episodes and um, all of that like some of the bigger YouTubers, pretty much any big Minecraft YouTuber, they'll, they'll space it out. They'll put in like 12 hours worth of work and they'll make an episode around that and be like, all right, we have made the beginning stages of this project. Uh, for me, I feel like I'm not at a place where I can do, uh, have that. Like I could have four episodes in my main series um, with the, the amount of work I have done so far in it and will continue to do work on it. 
But, yeah. So, that gives y'all just maybe a little bit of insight. Um, I try to put in a ton, a ton of work to try to stand out from everybody else on YouTube. I guess that's uh, what I try to do for the most part. Um, so, this is the island that I'll... I'm going to try to do the same thing, because we were swimming up this waterfall whenever it crashed. So my goal was to break this lapis block right here and catch it. Okay, here we go. Huh. I don't think I got it that time. Oh! Oh, I did get it. Wow, we are re <laughs> really far down. Alright, I tell you what. We're going to do a time lapse on that little island right there. No, don't fall again. Hmm, so I'm going to start the time lapse a little bit early and start it now. You know, guys, I really do enjoy that time-lapse music that I've been placing. I'll, I'll catch myself in the recording, and I'll just, like, replay it five times of just my little time-lapse fast-forward stuff. I love that in my videos. I hope you guys do, do too. Uh, that song makes me very happy. I don't know why. Uh, but that was the island we just time-lapsed. There's nothing in it but dirt. And I went and dropped off all the stuff, and I slept off the night, and we are back right here. So we are... Checking out four more islands, and we will be at our destination. So let's drop on down. And yeah, we got us uh, some nice little stuff. I wonder... See, it, it's weird what grabs my attention. I look at this, and I wonder, could I actually pull this off somewhere in, our, in my world as a design? Uh, they've done a few cool designs like this that I've really enjoyed. But let's see what this is all about. So, here's a piston. Can we go down a little bit more? Okay. So, it seems that the water is going to rush down onto this lava right here. Yeah. Well, let's go ahead and do it then. I wasn't planning on doing that. Uh, I was just planning on taking away the lava source block, but hey. I see it. Oh, that's pretty cool. And I guess that would be an easy way down, but let's just go like this. Is the water going away? Let's fall down onto it. That's not water. <laughs> okay. That almost got us killed. So let's check this out. Is there a chest underneath this obsidian? I'm so curious to see. Come on. Nothing. Yet. Nothing yet. This is a this is actually one of my more favorite islands. That was a very cool idea. And there it is. And there I fall. <laughs> uh, looks like some of the water has got caught down here. Okay, let's get rid of this and that. Okay. Not too shabby. I will take that. Thank you, Kirby and All-Star. Now let's come down here. Now this is a really cool looking island. Uh, can we... I don't think there's going to be anything else, but this is a flag... I guess this is a flagpole. Would there be anything underneath it, say here? Oh, some glowstone. Is there anything underneath the glowstone? 
I do have Silk Touch. Okay, yeah. Alright, good island. Th that was a very creative idea on how to do everything. I, I enjoyed this one thoroughly. Now I'm stuck on a... There we go. Okay, so I will see you guys back when we are up top. Okay, so we have made it back up to the top and we are moving onwards. Moving onwards. We got Uno Dos Trace Islands left. One, two, and three. Yes. Hi, Cal. Bye, Cal. Um, <laughs> I don't think there would be anything. Let's see if we can get a better look at this island. I guess we can go underneath real quick. Do we see? Oh, gosh. I am doing so bad in waterfalls today. This is ridiculous how much I've fallen. Um, yeah, I guess we could do one more time lapse. One more time lapse wouldn't be too terribly bad. So, yeah. Well, I might do a time lapse over there, though. I try to limit my episodes to two time lapses. Um, I tell you what, we'll just do a quick little search here, non time lapsable. And see, because I, I really doubt that there's anything here. Let's go down here. Yeah, I just saw the lapis. Let's move. Let, let's move onwards. I'm really wanting to go to that next island. I'm so indecisive right now. <laughs> so, all right, there we go. I guess I will harvest all of this. Why not? Some of that probably will land in the stream below. But okay, we are moving onwards. Now we got to be very careful with this island. Yeah, I don't see anything really underneath. I guess that's a little bit of coal. We can live without coal. Hmm. Okay. Ow. Interesting. Would there be anything here? Alright, we will have to do a little bit of a time lapse, I guess, on this one. Here we go now. So, I have decided that we've been playing too passive lately. Not not aggressive enough, alright guys? Not aggressive enough. Uh, we've been playing it safe, so we wouldn't die here in the beautiful Isles of Eden. And I'm letting the sun set. Yes, you heard it here first. I am letting the sun set and allowing the moon to rise. That is right. We're going to be fighting our way onto this next island. The final island of today's episode. And possibly retrieve some wool. Oh, something just fell right there. That was weird. Alright. I'm hope I'm going to back up again just for a second. Allow any more to spawn. And we're going to go head on over here. Now I'm trying to see. Okay. my You know what my concern is always, guys. Skeletons that ping you off. Here we go, here we go, here we go. And. Ah, oh, there's like nothing here. Oh, okay. Yeah, there, there's definitely some things here. <laughs> oh, no. Oh! Okay. <laughs> we need to back it on up, back it on up for a minute. Where's my. There we go. I got my uh oh apple on my bar. Down. Jeez. <laughs> you look so fun. Oh, whoa. Ninja creeper. I didn't realize they had tree creepers in the Isles of Eden. Oh. Right, Stop it. Stop it. You want to fight? Let's fight. Get owned. My bow is more epic than yours. Alright. Let's go over here. That tree. Can they shoot through this? They can't. Ha. Ah. Oh. I'm like camouflage. They'll never find me. 
This zombie either really doesn't spot me or he's having a hard time. I, I poke my head. Yep. Wow. That is interesting to me. I will take that. Stop it. Stop it. These creepers are coming from the trees. It's terrifying. They, they kind of blend in with the vines. Nope. Oh, this isn't good at all. Oh, this isn't good at all. Back it on up. Let's get your health up. What are you doing running around like a madman? Okay. Oh, I see you. Oh, get owned. Yes. Okay, let's start lighting up the area. Um, this is a very beautiful island. I've been wanting to come here for a long time. I've been, I've been able to see it uh, pretty much from our spawn area for a while now. And I've been kind of holding off on this island for a while. And I've tried to build some stuff like this in my world, like a massive tree. It's never worked out. I've always tried to do, do it first in a creative test world, and it just looks rough. You guys might have seen some shots of it whenever we're in our creative world. You'll see it in the background. It's very tough to miss, but yeah, you need to die. Thank you. And I want that. But yeah, uh, you might hear me repeat this again on my main series, but um, the hardcore sea lovelies I know are here. The, the diehard of the diehard. So I know you guys don't mind hearing stuff first before everybody else, and before I repeat it later, possibly. Uh, I have a theory with 4J Studios. Um, recently, they just started uh, tweeting out plush toys. Okay. So that means a new update's coming. Now they're going to do one more bug update, and then they're going to release a big update soon enough. Huh. Okay, this might be our clue then to getting in. Just one random spruce wood log compared to everywhere else. I'll find that interesting. Okay, but back to my little thing. And a lot of kids are about to get out of school here in about a month. So my guess is that there's going to be a big update of Minecraft for the Xbox within the next six weeks. Okay, six weeks. And I'm looking forward to that. And so we are making all the preparations to expand our world within the next few, within the next month. Uh, that, that's my goal. And if they release servers as a thing, I'm going to be so happy because then my friends can play whenever they want. Um, J Dog, Achilles, and Exalted. And it'll be awesome. It'll be lovely. I cannot wait for that day. And so my kind of my single player world esque feeling, it's, it feels more like a single player world, I would say. Like we don't ever, like my friends will show up from time to time, but we, we really don't ever do much on there together uh, because I'm always just focused on my YouTube channel, trying to get good videos out for you guys. So it'll be nice to let them have their own areas, do whatever they want, get on whenever they want. Uh, but yeah, so let's focus in now. Let's focus in on this. And, yeah. All right, everything's lit up now. Let's just say I wanted to come in here. What would what would happen if I tried to... Okay, bedrock. And I, I guess I could technically climb up. Yeah, I could climb up, like, right there and then break the leaves and go up. But let's, let's play it like how they want us to play it. And I believe it's... Oh. I really thought this was going to be an entrance in. I really did. Is this, is this really not an entrance in? Nothing? And then it's like... Huh. See... I might have to look after this, because I, I think now the goal is to go on top of the tree and fall in. Huh. Alrighty then. Well, they tricked me there. I was not expecting that. 
So, I guess we will climb up the tree then. That was just a chest. Okay. I like these type of islands. They, they put in a lot of work on this one. So, if I climb up here... Bedrock still. Okay. Sorry I don't have a night vision potion for you guys. So y'all can see a little bit better. Okay. We are here. Let's just throw uh, down a few torches. To mark our... Climbing of this tree. Come on, give me in. Okay. Let's light up a little bit more. Uh-huh. Is that a double chest? Yeah, that's a double chest. And there's a single chest. So here's the thing now. Let's go down here. Okay. No creepers. Oh, we got this. We got this in the bag. Let's go. Been hearing those guys. Good deal. Let's open this up. Sand. Oh, okay, so we can get back up. It's very generous of them. Hold on. Before I open it up, let's see. What can I dump off? That. 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 Yeah. All right. Are you ready, guys? I think this is going to be... I think this is going to be some wool. And... We have found the brown wool. That makes sense. Brown like like the trees. This was a very fun little island. I enjoyed this. Let's see. Is there any... Would there have been any ways to get in other than the top? That's what I want to know. And it doesn't look like it. Let's see. Is there anything else? Or is it just like this all the way around? I want to make sure that we did this right. And it looks like we did. And we got some more wood, so that's always great. Getting more wood um, so that I can build all that scaffolding to island to island. Alright. Good deal. I don't think there'd be really any other secrets here. This, this is the focal point, clearly. And I don't know if they would focus on the rest of the island to try to get some stuff. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Uh, let's get lock on the bar. Break you. Place you there. Very good. Very good indeed. And it's daytime again. Let's go on top of the tree. Can we go on top of the tree real quick? Oh yeah, I wanted to see if there'd be anything um, up in the top of these trees. I feel like that would be something they would possibly do. Um... Let's take a peek. Hmm. Anything? Maybe that tree? That looks like a nice looking tree. Would they hide anything within the tops of the trees? That's what I want to know. Oh, okay, that scared me. Alright. I'll tell you what. If you see a time lapse after this, that means we're going to end up finding something. If not, then I will see y'all back at the home island. By the way, guys, I've been slowly collecting the nether wart now. So I am preparing for a future battle, possibly, uh, with the ender dragon. Some of my subscribers said uh, that another YouTuber has confirmed that there is a, a dragon fight, possibly, in this world. So if that's the case... I am preparing for it. It's going to be glorious that day. And we are getting one step closer to finishing the series, guys. And it's going to be sad whenever the series is over with. Because I've really, really enjoyed this. Um, but yes, it is time to place the brown wool. Pow. Check it out, guys. Look at that. Yeah, we, we've made a lot of good progress in this world, guys. So we got some cyan wool, and we got some light gray wool remaining. 
and they're going to be somewhere over there. I've seen two possible islands that might harbor these last two. And um, so, yeah, we're, we're, we're getting pretty close to wrapping the series up. I think next episode what we'll end up doing is going back towards the... Uh, the end island and by the pirate ship and all that good stuff if you guys remember those we're gonna go back that way and we're gonna go left just like we did today we were we're covering a lot of islands uh, i'm thinking maybe four episodes remaining in the series maybe five uh but it is time to say our goodbyes my sweet lovelies i must go back and record our uh, main let's play series and i need a name for that series so i'm just calling it my main series <laughs> But alright guys, I hope you enjoyed today. If you can, please leave a like. Likes do go a long way. I've noticed the likes have dipped a little bit. A little bit lower than usual in the Isles of Eden. So hopefully that can get picked back up. And guys, you have a beautiful, beautiful day. <laughs> Deuces. <laughs>